This camper van is the Lino C550 uh, from Bosna, active. What's good about this and what's interesting about this is its size. It's only 550 centimeters. Uh, oh, sorry, 553. Oh, there's a bit of false information there. Uh, 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 long, 206 centimeters wide. Look, uh, you can put five people in sleeping. That's ridiculous. Uh, 70,250 it costs. And uh, right, let's have a peek around at it. Now, putting five people in here, this, that, that, that really is silly. I mean, mind you, uh, if you wanted to carry five, uh, my suggestion is get a bigger van. Uh, because if not, or you can rent it, rent it with five in, no problem at all, only you'll never want to go camping again. But if there's one of you or two of you, you've got here a really compact vehicle with everything you're likely to need. So you've got storage for your clothes, you've got a big bed, uh, for me it'd be comfortable, I can't say comfortable for everybody. Uh, you've got two burners to do your cooking, you've got a sink to wash up anything, and you've also got in here, in here, Sorry, <laughs> you've got your toilet and you've got uh, your shower. So it's a fully, uh, what do you call it? Um, I've forgotten the word now. Uh, fully, fully, fully enclosed now. So there's a word, a specific word for them. You've got everything in here. So you, you, can, you don't need to uh, stay on a campsite or anything like that. You've got plenty of space for everything. So, um, what's also good is the footprint. Not much bigger than that of a car. Okay, it's a bit wider than a car. Yeah, there's not many cars at 206 centimeters uh, wide, but um, in fact, probably aren't any at all. But uh, it, 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 the, you'll get, okay, you'll almost get into all parking spaces in this. So this, it, now I put the word tiny camper to be 500, 40 centimeters that's my definition because to be a proper camper it's got to have the shower it's got to have the, uh, um, the toilet without that it doesn't qualify as being a camper in my opinion that is a car this is a camper it's a small camper uh, we've got here electricity on hookup we've got 12 uh, 12 volts here uh, more storage yeah, um, this definitely is good for me. Um, and we've also got, I shall demonstrate here, oh, if I can lift it up, there's space in the double floor. And obviously, as you'd expect, there's a bit of uh, space in the back. Now, this stuff here is to make up an extra bed. Uh, so my advice is don't. Um, if you start carrying stuff around with you, then extra like it's just taking up space. So you don't have space for the things. So my idea is get a bigger van if you want to take. Or, or, but whatever you do. As I always say, don't buy rent. And if you rent, uh, then you'll see if it's any good or not. That is the, that's the whole thing. That's the whole point. So, uh, there you go. A small camper with uh, lots of possibilities, in my opinion. Could, in theory, replace your daily vehicle, maybe. So, thanks for watching, hope you found it interesting. I upload every day at 21.15. Uh, if you want to see more, this is, got, this is the largest collection of motorhomes and camper vans on YouTube. So, if you're interested in that type of thing, then subscribe. All the best from me.